Crepes and Waffles is a Colombian restaurant chain known for its high quality and low price meals. Its speciality is sweet and salty crepes, but they also offer a variety of salads and ice cream flavors. In order to understand the research objectives and results, we must familiarize with the portion sizes and flavors of ice cream. In crepes and waffles, you can order either one or two scoops and choose between having it on, in a cone or in a cup. If you want to take your ice cream home, you can also order buckets of different volumes. There are approximately 27 ice cream flavors. The most ordered ones are chocorrochel, arequipe, pistacho, almendra, avellana, yogurt, lemon cheesecake, among others. It is also important to know about the competition. In Bogotá, there are many gelaterias, such as Orso, Popsi, Michel, and others. With the purpose of gathering information about the feelings and impressions that consumers experience when buying an ice cream in crepes and waffles, we visited the restaurants in different locations around Bogotá. Our research objectives are the following. What are the feelings that consumers experience when eating an ice cream in crepes and waffles? In which occasions do consumers go for an ice cream in crepes and waffles? How comfortable are consumers while eating an ice cream at the point of sale? How many scoops do consumers ask for? And which flavors are the most ordered? What are the main facial expressions consumers reflect while eating an ice cream? For our quality research, we use a direct and an overt observation. We observed behaviors as they occurred and consumers were notified they were being observed. Additionally, we carried on structured observations as all behaviors were taken into account and monitored. The field work was done on a Wednesday between 11 a.m. and 3 p.m. and we visited Crepes and Waffles on Plaza 39, Atlantis, Zona T, Andino and Zona G. Influencers and constraints such as the day in the week time in the day, weather and location of the point of sales might alter the results. We discovered that during lunchtime, a lot of people prefer to eat salty plates. They prefer to eat the ice cream as a dessert or in the afternoon hours such as 4 p.m. Temperature in Bogota plays a very important role when people make the decision of eating an ice cream. Temperature in Bogota on an average, it's between 10 degrees Celsius and 20 degrees Celsius on a normal day. Even though that today, when we made our research, the day was cloudy, people still ate ice cream. We also noticed that before the consumption of the ice cream, people tended to ask for samples to see which flavor they would prefer. Once they got their ice cream, the facial expression on consumers' faces reflected happiness and joy, and they didn't wait much to have the first try. In crepes, many people prefer to sit down in a sofa or in a table inside the restaurant to eat their ice cream. They usually stick around with the company that they go, and they talk for a while while they eat their ice cream. In gelaterias, which are more to go, People do not stick around. Instead, they order their ice cream and they just go away walking with their ice cream. This occurs because in the gelateria, there is not as much sitting tables or sofas as in the restaurant. So people do not feel comfortable enough. In looking at consumers' outfits during this time of the day, we could identify that most of them were workers who were enjoying their lunch time uh, with their colleagues. There were also groups of students and friends in the case of Plaza 39 and Zona G. Finally, the majority of the people only order one scoop and in a cone. During our observation time in crepes and waffles, we observed that the most ordered ice cream was Choco Rochelle and Vanilla Old Style. To complete our research, we took into account social media, specifically hashtags from Instagram where we evidence that, that people relate eating ice cream with happiness. Some of the hashtags said, happy day, happiness, feliz dia, among others that express the happiness they feel when they go to eat an ice cream. Also, we evidence that people tend to go to crepes and waffles when they want to celebrate a moment of love or to uh, pass a moment with their couple. An example of this is the hashtag that said um, uh, crepes lovers or 
um, I love you or some types of hashtags that express love. In addition, we evidence that people go to crepes and waffles to celebrate special occasions, such as birthdays. And finally, people uh, go to crepes and waffles to spend time with their family and friends.